Hi, so today I'm visiting um, a Skulpturen Park in Wuppertal, uh, which is like a sculpture park here in uh, North Rhine-Westphalia. And um, it's a park that was uh, created by Tony Craig, British slash German artist. He moved to Germany many, many years ago and now um, he's got this wonderful sculpture park and I'm gonna show you a little bit of it today. The work of Tony Craig is a successful marriage between the materials and movement. Craig admits he was at some point inspired by the dancer Pina Bausch, influential artist and the founder of Tanztheater Wuppertal, Pina Bausch. Just as our eyes follow the dancer's movements, the Craig sculpture makes us follow his abrupt lines and creates an original dynamic. It is by no means a museum of one artist. Craig invited many other sculptors to create for his park. My personal favorite is Wave by the Swedish artist Eve Hild and her distinguished serpentine lines. Or the work of the Spanish artist Jomo Plenza, Mariana W's world. The distorted head of the girl might bewilder the viewer's vision from the first sight, her stretched, gooey, almost soft head, albeit made of marble, communicates rather a meditative feeling addressing to one's inner world. Or how about this playful amorphous trash stone by Wilhelm Mund that proves that art can be very much sustainable and eye-pleasing at the same time? The colorful polyester containers consist of the waste from the artist's work. Roaming around the sculptures and trees, or hiding in one of the two pavilions with the temporary exhibitions, is your choice. In any case, it is a great location for a short escape away from the industrial sites and monotonous buildings of the noisy cities. <laughs> 